This is the article. Trapped in tar. Walk down a paved black road on a hot summer day, and you might find your shoes starting to sink in. That's because high heat makes the road surface soft. If this happens, you are probably walking on asphalt or tar. Luckily, you won't sink in very far. But twenty-eight thousand years ago, bubbling black asphalt deposits or tar pits swallowed up a great many unlucky animals. Possibly thinking they had found water, the mammoths or ground sloths blundered into pits of sticky, gooey tar. Instead of a drink or a bath, a trap held them fast forever. These same tar pits still bubble today in the middle of Los Angeles, California, one of the largest American cities. But what was bad luck for prehistoric animals has meant good luck for paleontologists, scientists who study fossils. Known as the Rancho La Brea tar pits, the bubbling pools of asphalt contain the remains of woolly mammoths, saber-toothed cats, giant sloths, and other now extinct beasts. This makes the La Brea tar pits one of the world's richest sources of fossils. This skull of a saber-toothed cat from the La Brea tar pits is the only one ever found with its mouth closed. Paleontologists at work at Los Angeles's Page Museum. The asphalt in these pits has been oozing from the ground for about forty thousand years, and more than three million fossils have been found. In addition to mammoths, tigers, and sloths, paleontologists have found the remains of horses, coyotes, wolves, bison, birds, rodents, and insects, many in perfect condition. Today, the La Brea tar pits are part of Los Angeles's Page Museum, whose current hotspot is Pit 91. Paleontologists keep finding thousands of fossils in this pit under the watchful eyes of visitors. After seeing complete animal skeletons and learning how the animals became trapped in tar, a visitor to the Rancho La Brea tar pits might feel lucky. Those animals met a fate much worse than leaving a shoe print behind on a black-topped road.